Hello folks, and welcome back to Let's Play 7th Saga. I'm your host, the Game of Darius. Last time I left off, I had crash-landed on this little teeny tiny little island called... I remember it. I also did a little bit of grinding because... Uh, this place will kind of sort of maybe kick my ass. Just the slightest bit. So, we've been told that this place is in pieces and that we should head in which direction was it crap I'll remember when we get out of the place I swear it, it's totally not been a little bit since I picked this back up again honest all right uh, status no nope. map it was the map that I need okay so, I'm not sure if we actually have to go east right now, or we gotta go south and then east. Let's try east right now for a second. And maybe I can show off some of these beastly beasts that are in this area. Or we could find some old stuff that we've been fighting this entire, like, five last episodes. Could do that. But hey, at the least now, uh, you guys will be able to sample my power. So much so that that guy ran away. And this guy's powering up. The douche. Let's defend again. And die. Thank you. Now, I mostly did grind in order to get some of the newer weapons, but, you know, it was a happy little coincidence. Okay, I don't think it is in that direction I need to go. So let's go south. Eh. Damn it. I was ducking and diving away from all those monsters. And hello. Remember before this, the uh, monsters despair? I think this one's called Doom. Just, I mean, look at it. It looks very doomy. Cast a bunch of fire spells. Even has a vacuum spell, if I remember. Which, by the way, the harp prevents the vacuum. Which I'm pretty sure I remember putting as a little text note when I was playing last time. You sons of bitches. Oh yeah, I also got the fireball spell. That's what it looks like. It's a pretty gnarly spell. I always thought that that was fire too. Oh well. Uh, if I cast a second time, they're all dead. Sounds like a plan to me. Do this fast. Yes. Murder them good. Melt them down into the junk heaps of fire that they are. Sounds a little bit darker than I had planned on saying, but eh. Alright. Ah, more random encounters. Don't worry, we'll get to our destination eventually, if this thing doesn't murder me. Yeah, critical hits. At least the dooms are worth a pretty decent amount of experience. How far am I? Wow. I'm like 10 more dooms away from a full level. I might as well just heal too. I moved like 5 steps that time. Another doom. There's other, more interesting monsters on this area, I swear. We just never freaking get to see them, apparently. Yeah, it's good to know that that's not a fire, too. That's just a fireball. I mean, I had a tiny fireball. Hmm. Let's see. I'm gonna magic it. It's a little bit late, so this is probably the only video that I'm going to try to record. Ah, damn it. Don't follow the coast, folks. You will find only doom! Nice, nice. Can I hit him with just that? Yes. Excellent. Come on. I just want to get to... The place I need to go. 
which if I recall is a cave. Because the last rune is somewhere on this aisle. And once we find the rune, we'll have the power to do whatever we wish, essentially. I forget exactly what the purpose is that uh, Chad had for getting all the runes. You know, that's a good question. I gotta check the wiki page on that. Ah, screw you guys. Damn it. I just wanna leave. I wanna get the runes. You guys are stopping me from doing that. Don't make me vacuum you. I will totally vacuum you. Kind of a weird threat when I say it out loud like that. I'll totally vacuum you. Alright, nope. Still gotta go south along the mountains. More doom. At least though, I'm not as afraid of the dooms as before. One, I know that their big powerful thing of vacuum is not as hazardous. B, I can survive through all their spells. Might mostly be because I had power leveled a little bit, but regardless, power and you know, able to li live through their spells. I only power level because of money. God damn it, there's other more interesting monsters in this area, guys. I guess they're just that rare. You took none of the MP, you idiot. Alright. Try to think uh, what other enemies were actually in this area. No, not magic. Okay. A little bit more south and then just back up to the north to follow along the mountains. La 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 bastards. Well, that guy ran away, which I'm happy for. He typically likes to improve defenses, which is... Not something that makes me happy. Oh, well, now you just die. Getting my freaking cables all freaking gathered up and whatnot. Anyways, south, east, gotta go north. Ah, stop it with the doom. So I've recently also had someone in my comment section uh, suggest that, oh hey, play through the game with the other characters, and you know what? I wouldn't be opposed to this idea. Uh, it's just going to take a long time. Like seeing the different play styles of the different characters and certain characters I'm essentially going to need to have a companion with, like uh, Valsu. Valsu who is so terribly physically weak. It is ridiculous. I actually remember one of the first times I was deciding to play was like, Oh, hey, a healer guy. I should be just fine with a healer. And I knew this was the first time I was playing uh, Seventh Saga, the US version, not the hacked version. I can't, don't know why I worded it like hacked. Anyways. And, um... No. <laughs> Maybe he stands a better chance with the game being hacked, so as it's closer to the original Japanese version, but... Nah. No thank you. Leveled up. Man, plenty of speed. Alright. We enter here. We're gonna come out the other side of this mountain, supposedly. Uh, let's try this way first. Because goodies can't take any more potion threes. That's right. For once, I'm actually full on potion threes. Not some. Oh, those are better than spidex, aren't they? I mean, they don't. Uh, yep. Okay. They don't hit very hard at all. Or are these spidex? And I'm just not remembering their color. P moon. What? Poison Moon. Okay. P Moon. Just eh. something spider. Poison spider. Moon spider. Moon sp. 
that'll work just as well. Come on. Come at me. I don't want you to dodge. These videos aren't supposed to be super mega long. I just want you to die. And that's an MP. Why'd you steal my MP when I have none? Idiot. Well, let's see. There's plenty of loot down here, too. So I might as well grab it if my controller would let me dodge. Defend. Attack. You know those P-Moons are actually fairly decent for experience. No joke, I mean, I would stay in- I can't take the harp because I got too many. No joke, I would totally stay in here and just grind on them if I wasn't already pretty ass nightly leveled for this area. Before the hack. And of course, if I wasn't going to lose my patience with three at a time. Alright, go up here. Ah, M water, which is useless. Because I am but a sink and no more harps. And there's an item over there, which I might as well grab. I did also use all of those seeds to the best of my ability, too. I, I got a little bit impatient, though and had used them when I had seen... Oh, you got plus three to your speed. Because, no... There's no way I was going to sit there for an hour essentially trying to use speedrun tactics for random generation sort of things. I don't even know how that shit works. So, yeah. Save the topaz. Did I... Was there anything this way? There shouldn't be anything this way. Fight me. You dick. Stupid spiders. Stop stealing my MP, I don't have any. Oh, excuse the yawn. Oh. So that's what happens when you let the poison take effect for a while. It just kind of dong, dong, as though counting down your health. It's a pretty neat effect. I actually like it. Uh, just let me leave. My poison? Did that poison me that time? They're, they're not letting me leave. Probably would have had this beaten by now, but meh. I am resilient. More like easily annoyed. More spiders. You know what? Fine, I'll kill these ones. There's only two. There's not like three of them. And they're still idiots in that they're trying to st mm, heal my MP. Uh, poison moons. Moon, which reminds me that it is in fact nighttime. Poison, reminding me that I should not be staying up so late, but it's kind of fruitless for me. Oh. The pain is unbearable. Oh, now a pretty gnarly thing has happened to me. I am now unable to use magic. Yep. I mean, not that it really mattered for me in the first place because not a magic key character. I'm not Valsu or Esna or Legis. Oh, finally one of the other interesting monsters comes around. That is a sword. I'm not shitting you on the name, that is its name. It is called Sword. It has a pretty insane attack. <laughs> its defense is pretty stupid high, to the point where you only deal one damage to it. It gives that much experience. 
and it only has 4 HP. But because its defense is so high, it doesn't have to worry about that. Another fun factor of it is that it drops like every single sword in the game up to this point, including one of the web one of the only swords that um Lumi. Lumi? Yeah, the alien guy can equip. So if you are playing as Willby in this, and you want a good weapon for him at this point. This is, uh, this is the place to grind for it. Because, seriously, like, one of the only weapons in the game that he can wield. Uh, hello, Griffins. These were Griffins, right? I remember the cocoon, I don't remember the Griffin. Ha! Screw you, I've got harps. Does that make sense? A harp prevents me from being sucked into another dimension and instantly dying. You, stop your thunder shit. And of course he runs away. Yeah, it was Griffins. I remember them having some sort of stupid name like that. Or at least a name that does not fit, fit their mythology, as it were. Ah, where am I now? Town of Bogast. Gesundheit. Many warriors and wizards have recently come to our town. I wonder what is happening on this continent. Would you happen to mean some of the other remaining alive uh, apprentices? The people of Guanta still remember many of the old villages. Go and visit the village. Guanta, that's north of here, isn't it? What do you have to say? Something must be very wrong if the monsters can spread all over like this. I mean, have the monsters been this constant around the area? Like, at all? Tonaka can cure anything. Tonoka. Tonoka. I'm guessing Tonoka is not here. And that Tonoka is, in fact, at Guanta Village. Or this is her. You're lucky, let me look at, have, take a look at you. Hmm. Ah. Uh, oh, I see. Looks like you are being cursed. And that's why you can't use magic. Do you have any idea who might have done this to you? Or if the people of Guanta have anything to do with this? Go to the village of Guanta and see what happens. Guanta, which is way up north. Which really, it doesn't matter whether or not we can cast magic. I mean, A, we're a fighter, so pff, magic, whatever. And B, we got the runes, man. We don't have to worry about magic. I am worried about instantaneously dying, but unfortunately we can't buy any freaking harps from here. Uh, how's the weapon shop? Uh, weapons. Sell me weapons. A fire sword. Which I totally don't have something better than. Nature Spear? Drop my attack. Why is it so expensive if it drops my attack power by 23? What the hell? So expensive for a freaking. Ah. I don't know, maybe that's meant for another character. Drops my defense by 10. Crin Mask, which won't be better than my Crin Mask, which only is worn by Essena. Da, bom, 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 bom. The air is frozen. I've never seen this much snow around here in my life. Ah, there's the inn. Might as well talk to the other people. You look pale. Go and see the woman called Tanoka. This town is Bugus. Oh, I, I see. I seem to have come full circle. Well, I've come full circle in a very square sort of manner. Yes. Uh, no one else in here? Huh. For a place that the lady at the front of the town said, Oh, we're bustling with a bunch of adventurers. Lady has an extremely low-sounding voice all of a sudden. That, uh many jars. Mm. That, uh, still seems pretty dead here. 
even for a place that is so bustling as they had said. In any case, I suppose this is a, as good of a place to call an episode. Yeah. Yes. And when we return, I guess we're going to go north to... I totally forgot the name already. It's a place. Play! Uh, maybe we'll regain our magics when we get there. I've already seen the woman called Tonoka. Anyways, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers!